This is the story of how I turned this. See me in a red dress, hopping on the deathbed, thinking of love, just they judge and discuss. Into this. They see me in a red dress, hopping on the deathbed, thinking of love, just they judge and discuss. And if you're wondering, yes, my microphone stand broke again, so. I'm back to holding it. <laughs> Red Dress by Sarah Brand is an international pop hit, gaining 1 million views in one month. But the reason for it blowing up aren't because people enjoy the song for being good, it's the opposite. People enjoy it because it's bad. People are laughing at it for being out of tune and whatever, but stop, okay? We're all just people with dreams. Not that dream, that's the wrong dream. Watch out next week for Dream's new controversy, hashtag not my dream. Wrong dream. But anyway, the song is gaining mass appeal and virality and was sent to my favorite YouTuber to react to, Critical. His video reacting to the song was definitely a uh, knee slapper and the song really struck a chord with me. But I thought, in all seriousness, this song has potential. It's not a bad song and I can prove it. So I set out on a journey. Let's make Red Dress great. Again. Oh. I was really confident about turning this song around into a platinum hit, but I got too cocky. The song posed a real challenge for me to overcome. The challenge? I had to figure out what the melody was even supposed to sound like. And someone else behind the wheel. Guys, it was nearly impossible for me to find out what the melody was even supposed to sound like. So I took the lazy route and decided to start with the instrumental of the song, therefore procrastinating that I was going to have to figure out the melody at one point or another. The best way to do projects. As a seasoned multi-platinum producer, you might be surprised to find out that I didn't have the best equipment to record my acoustic guitar and have it sound good, even though I could play. I can play the guitar, I swear, I'm not lying. So I turned to fiber guitarist Max Trends. Hi, this video is sponsored by I'm just kidding. God, I wish I was sponsored. I hired Max Trends to play the guitar part for me in this song, and I paid extra for him to send it to me fast, before I lost motivation to even try. Now, in the meantime, while I was waiting for Max to send me the guitar part, I started crafting the other parts of the instrumental, like the drums, bass guitar, and a f church organ to really nail in the theme of the song. Now the challenge arose. It was time for me to figure out how the vocals even go. After re-listening to this masterpiece over and over again, I thought I came to a breakthrough. No, I still have no idea how this goes. So I had to take my own creative liberty with the verses of the song, but I kept the artistic integrity of how the chorus, the hook, was supposed to go, as intended. Thinking of the last as they judge and disgust. And after waving a magic wand, the song was done. Mwah. It was time to make the video. I came to church. For the video, I needed a red dress. Red dress! Red dress! Red dress. Red dress. You might think such clothing already exists in every female identifying person's closet, but it does not. I hate the color red on me, so I had to go spend my painstakingly hard-earned cash on a red dress that I will never wear again. So if you want to support me with that spicy, juicy ad revenue, smash that subscribe button because I can barely afford red. Now, after all this preparation, after remaking this song from scratch, and even buying a red dress that I very much regret buying, the song? was done. Everything was done. The video was done. Now, before I show you this final product, I want to say that I'm like 80% sure the song is satire, right? And this song definitely has potential. I thought the lyrics and meaning of the song were unique and funny, and it's obvious Sarah doesn't take herself too seriously or the song too seriously, and I really admire that. For those of you without ears, the song is about going to church for some guy, probably in order to get married in the church or something like that, and Sarah realizes this all just doesn't align with her worldview and values, and decides to wear this red dress to symbolize breaking free from societal norms, and maybe I'm reading reading too much into it. Anyway, this was a blast to remake. Don't forget to show Sarah some love, and here it is. Came to church to praise our love Sit and come for someone else It didn't do well with me But I said it was a love first deed I didn't trust
coming for someone.